What on earth is the difference between rational and irrational numbers? On the board, you can see three over two, which is rational, and root two, which is irrational. Fun fact, root two is the first number ever to be discovered to be irrational. Now, a rational number is a number that can be represented as a fraction. I'm going to say p divided by q. So these are just whole numbers. And that's one of the conditions. So it's a fraction where p and q are whole numbers. Now the technical word for that is integers. Are uh, integers. And one thing that's really important, the denominator cannot be zero. Yeah, we're not allowed to divide numbers by zero. A further condition is that all fractions must be represented in their simplest form. So for example, if I had two quarters, that's just a half. A half is unique. So there's a technical word for that. So we don't say P and Q are in their simplest form. It doesn't really make sense. In maths, there is a technical term for this. P and Q are co-prime. Now what co-prime means is that together, the largest number that goes into them is one. Yeah, so for example, if you had three and two, and I said, what are the factors of three and two? You would say one is the only one that's common in both. So this is a rational number. Root two is irrational because we can't write as a fraction. Some of you might say root two over one, but this number is not an integer. So guys, that's the difference between a rational and irrational number. Nice. Follow me for more content like this.